Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Baritone. In today's video, we're going to test out can Pokemon Unite boot up on the Yuzu emulator. Before we get started this video, please make sure guys you like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new because it greatly helps out the channel a lot. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Now, do keep in mind, I'm very aware that this is a 100% online based game, but I want to see how far I can take to the Yuzu emulator if I can get to the title screen or even I can, who knows, gameplay. I might play with CPUs, but it doesn't hurt to try. So, all right, I got the game. So I'm going to from my desktop, highlight it, select the folder, and there you go. Pokemon Unite, not tested at all on the Yuzu emulator whatsoever. I think this game came out like three days ago. All right, we're going to test it out and see. What can we get out of it? Now I know, um, I believe the, I think it was like five months ago or six months ago that the Yuzu emulator, well the early access build had um, online capabilities, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, something, got something booting up. 10 cent games. Wow, we get to the title screen. It's really crazy that as the user emulator can play games like whatever new Nintendo Switch game that's first party that comes out, the Yuzu emulator can automatically play it. And also the Ryu Jinx. It's, it's crazy that we in the timeline and emulation that we can play current games. I know that it used to be like that with other Nintendo games, but like our uh, actual more strong, more like a console. I know we can do did it back in the day with um, DS, GBAs. Like I believe when black and white was and was like released in japan and we have to wait one year for it to release in the u.s we can already play it inside the the ds emulators which is pretty cool back in the day there's like little fond memories i had but yeah it gets to the title screen let's see if we can skip this and see if we can get to the gameplay <laughs> like i said we might play cpus or something nope Nothing at all. Yep. That's what we get. Basically nothing. Just go all the way to the title screen. Yep, it just gets to the title screen. <laughs> worth the shot, right? <laughs> it was well worth the shot. So that's basically about it. I I have a good feeling that we're gonna figure out or a workaround um from this. I don't know Parasec might have an update. Or who knows, the Yuzu emulator might bring back the online feature if they're not too scared of Nintendo coming after them. But anyways, that's about it for the video. If you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to like, share, and also subscribe. And yeah, guys, this is your boy Braytone. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.